CQ, CQ, CQ. This is November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. Summit's on the air. I think so. Well, good morning. Um, we are up here at Tijana Mesa. I hope I pronounced that right. It's T-E-J-A-N-A. -A. Tejana? Anyway, we're in New Mexico right now. And uh, Ray and I are going to try to get a first activation, which means this has never been activated before. Um, it's practically a drive up um, if you got all-wheel drive and, and a little bit of clearance um, It was sketch. I brought the uh, the uh, backup Transportation mode here in case I got uh, stuck or was then I able to go a little bit farther so um, But I can drive practically into the AZ. We're about oh, I'm what five feet of elevation climb before we get in to the um, summit here so, um, yeah, we're, we're ready to roll. Hey, Ray, you ready to go? Let's get our pack on. Hey, speaking of packs, Ham Ninja picked up another one here. It's 10 liters smaller. It's a Zulu 30. I believe it's similar to the one uh, Charlie carries, NJ7 Vicht. So, um, got this one here. And uh, it forces me to carry a little bit lighter. I'd say the only... Uh, thing I have against it is being smaller everything fits a little bit tighter um, I can bring just about everything else that I brought before maybe a little bit less which is a good thing um, but I kind of like the 40 liter just a little bit uh, looser fit and it has that top loader too so or side loader however you want to configure it um, so that'd be the only kind of knit I have of the pack um, I've got it down to 21 pounds with two liters of water. So uh, running light and uh, yeah, it should be a fun day. We're up here. It's about 72 degrees right now. We're gonna go through this gate over here and uh, then walk up to the summit. Uh, like I said, we're almost in the AZ, but uh, let's get up there so we can get a nice, uh, a nice east-west reach and to the north. Just about good to go here in the north. So Ray, you ready to go? She's like, I smell all kinds of cool stuff out here. This is going to be a pretty easy uh, trek up here. Oof. Ray's excited. Actually, if you went through that gate, it looks like uh, somebody's driven up here. A little uh, Jeep trail. I don't want to get my vehicle into anything too soft up here. So I'm fine with uh, hiking this past. God, can't be even a quarter mile. Um, I'm kind of a ways from anything, so uh, I've had to call friends for help. I'd be out here for a while, but it did bring dinner, so I could go to the car and heat up dinner, and I'd be good to go. I like to leave some extra food in the vehicle in case I do have to hang out. Uh, got my jet boil and cook up a little gourmet stuff. Anyway. This is our trail. Ray's pretty stoked. I think she's just stoked to get out of the car. Like I said, it's about 72 degrees. Got up here about 9.30 local time, New Mexico time. So it's an hour difference than Arizona at, the, uh, at my Arizona. QTH, Soda Operations Center. Yeah. 
Just a comment about uh, the GoPro equipment. Great stuff, but you know, if you want to do, if you want to buy the media pack, which gives you an external antenna, excuse me, external antenna, an external mic, there's only one problem. When it comes time to do a battery change, you have to take it completely out of the case, which means disassembling some other stuff to change the darn battery. So, I don't know what GoPro was thinking, but there's not a whole lot of go when you have to do that. Anyway, let's get cracking. Ray wants to get going. Another piece of news, I'm already in the AZ. <laughs> i am uh, climbed up 45 feet so far. Super easy hike. A little bit of cactus around. So, but uh, the bushwhacking up here is easy peasy. Surprised I'm not seeing more cattle because it's so green up here. Uh, maybe they're gonna give this stuff a little bit more time to pop up. Beautiful day. Right. It's more or less flat. Um, we're in the AZ, well under the AZ. I'm gonna go, just keep going. Not walk into any cactus here. Uh, until I stop going up. Just get up as high as I can, just for the heck of it. We've probably hiked a quarter mile. Um, maybe our elevation gains at 50 feet now from the vehicle. Um, massive activation zone so if you got some buddies that want to come up with you do it really a great site for it hey in other news uh poda parks on the air i saw an announcement uh, that they're going to enable people to upload their own logs through a web interface so you might see me doing some poda in the future now that i can do that i've done one before it was a great bit of fun um, but the whole uploading logs was uh, preventing me from continuing that much further. It's a great outdoor activity. Um, all I had to do is drive into a park and get your gear out and start activating. I'm not, I'm not going to be able to quote all the rules about activating in your vehicle or away from the vehicle or what have you. Um, but uh, of course, a lot of parks have covers and a little bit, few, uh, few more amenities available. So, and of course, they're easy access. And a lot of folks live where there just aren't any mountains. Well, maybe like Kansas or Florida, where nothing sticks up 500 feet above the ground except maybe some tower. So, anyway, we're going to go up this little rise here. Looks like another 20 feet, maybe more. Let's see. Let's go. I love it when a plan comes together. We'll be sitting in the shade today. Good morning, November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. Is this Frequency News? Is this Frequency News? CQ, CQ, CQ. This is November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. CQ, CQ, CQ. For some it's on the air, any station, anywhere. Good morning. I got a Whiskey Bravo 6. Uh, go again, sir. Whiskey Bravo 6, Papa Oscar Tango. Okay, I got a Whiskey Bravo 6, pa Papa Oscar Tango. Good morning, Peter. And you're the first contact on a uh, the first activation here. Over. 
All right, QSL. Great, uh, great to hear that, Chris. I uh, hope you're having a great day. Have a lot of fun today. Uh, I got you about a five seven, five seven, Northern California. QSL, QSL. I got you five nine up here. Uh, great signal, man. All right. Thanks again for the activation. All righty, man. Seventy three. This is November one. Charlie Lima, Charlie. First activation. Whiskey seven, United Sugar Alpha. Whiskey seven, USA. Good morning, Raymond. Um, yeah, I've got you here at a solid 5.9, beautiful day up here. Okay, Chris, yeah, you got a banging signal here. I didn't think that was even a soda station. <laughs> You're 5.9 plus 10. 5.9 plus 10. True yeah. story, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, roger, roger. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Uh, activating this mountain for the first time. Okay, very good. Yeah, we did a couple a couple days ago and uh, recuperating. Uh, we had a thunderstorm on one of them. I had to cut it short. 73, have fun. Be safe. Alrighty, 73. No thunderstorms yet. N1 CLC, summit's on the air. Any station, anywhere. Whiskey 6, Romeo, Whiskey Sierra. Whiskey 6, Romeo, uh, Whiskey Sierra. Jacob, good morning. I got you at about a 5.7. Over. Roger, roger, and you're 5.7 as well. Congratulations on the first activation. QSL, QSL, you got some weird, uh, I think I got some digital uh, stuff coming in here. But anyway, got a great signal, man. Thanks for the, uh, thanks for the support. Yeah, man's not great right now, uh, so I'll, I'll let you go here, but uh, it's good to make contact. Have a good one there, 73. Already 73, Jacob, November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie, QRZ. November Golf 6, Romeo. November Golf 6, Romeo, that makes four. Thanks, Jerry, I got you a 5.9, five, 5.9 nine, five, nine on the summit. Okay, Chris, uh, thanks for a great signal report. Uh, you're 5.7, five, 5.7 seven, five, seven here in Southern Cal this morning. QSL, QSL, thanks for the 5.7, man. Uh, have an awesome day. Yeah, you too. Have a good day in G6R. Whiskey Zero, Mike, November Alpha. Whiskey Zero, Mike, November Alpha. Good morning, Gary. Uh, working the first activation up here on the hill. I got you 5-9. Okay, good morning, Christian, and uh, happy 4th. Uh, you're 5 nine here in Kansas. Good signal. Yeah, the bands are finally cooperating with us. Uh, appreciate the contact. Have a good time, me, and be careful, Iron. 7-3. Echo X-ray. 6 Yankee Kilo. Was that a Whiskey 4 Echo X-ray uh, come again? November 4, Echo X-ray. You were 5 by 6 all right, November 4 station, November 4 station, go again. Oh, Oh, man, I think I lost him at November 4 Echo X ray. Uh, Rich, you out there? This is November 4 Echo X ray. November 4 Echo X ray. One in between is 5-6-56. QSL, QSL, got you 5-5-5-5. Five, 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 five. Yeah, Roger, 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 Roger. I'm going to move up to, move up to, move up to. I'm on the digital signal as well. Kilo, Kilo, Kilo 6, Tango, Quebec. Kilo 6, uh, Tango, Quebec. Uh, good morning. I uh, got you at about a 5.9. Okay, QSL, I got you about 5.6 here in California. QSL, QSL. Thanks, David, for the, for the uh, contact. Have an awesome day. 73, November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie, Summit's on the air. Kilo United, go again. Kilo United for radio. Good morning, Robert. Kilo United for radio. I got you about a 5.7, 5.7. Oh, thanks for the activation, Chris. Good morning or good afternoon. Uh, you're 5.9, 59, good signal, over. Wow, that's awesome. Uh, where are you at, Robert? 73, good luck. Thank you for on. Alrighty, 73. This is November 1, Charlie Lima. Charlie, Summit's on the air. Kilo 6, Yankee Kilo. Kilo 6, Yankee Kilo, got you 5'8. Five, 5'8? Eight. Five, eight. Okay, Chris, got you there. You're about 5'3. 53, 53, over. QSL, QSL, fit for the 53. Thank you very much. Have an awesome day. N1 CLC, Summit's on the air.
CQ, CQ, November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie, for someone's on the air, any station, anywhere. All right, Ray, let's go do some chasing. 7264. CQ, 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 this is Charlie Lima, Charlie, 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 this is November 1, Charlie Lima Charlie. Good morning. November 1, Charlie Lima Charlie. Good morning. This yeah. is Kilo Zero, Michael Castillo. And you are 4444 four, four, four. QSL. QSL, QSL on the 44. Four. I got you 55, five, sir. 55 five on Whiskey Zero Charlie. Uh, excuse me. Uh, Whiskey 5 November. Whiskey 5 November. Alpha Papa 042. Over. Whiskey 5 November, stroke, Alpha Papa, Alpha Papa 042, over. Yeah. QSL, 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 have a uh, great hike today. There's your drone shot. Uninspiring, I know. Uh, this is like a big giant flat mesa. I'm gonna go down the road uh, at the end of the hike here and get a picture of kind of what I was on. Um, but beautiful day today. Uh, got some cloud buildups here. Give you a quick shot of that. If you didn't see it on the uh, on the drone, got some cumulonimbus uh, building to the south of me and uh, to the east. And looks like some over here to the west as well. Um, we're probably going to get some rain here today. Certainly out of that guy, that's that's going to be a big cumie there with some nice flat bottoms. So that means it's time to get out of here before the lightning starts uh, cracking down. Although we haven't had some any real bangers yet, so I don't think the uh, monsoons are in full force. But. Uh, <laughs> I think Ray is ready to get out of here. The gnats are driving her crazy. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna head on down the mountain here after we pack up. Um, the antenna for today, before I forget, is the K6 ARK random wire. I misstated in my last video that you know I didn't have to tune that much because it's it's resonant on uh, this frequency and that frequency. Actually, the point of a random wire is not to be resonant on any frequency. Um, it's worked pretty well today. I didn't get any DX. Uh, I think I did get a Canadian station, but uh, um, <laughs> it, it was a good time up here. I got a bunch of summit to summits, around 30 contacts, maybe five summit to summits. So thanks everyone for uh, chasing and being out there on another summit. So the gnats are driving me crazy as well. It's time to pack up. Alrighty. Well, we're gonna work ourselves off this uh, little uh, ridge line, hill, whatever you wanna call it. Doesn't seem like a mountain, but it was a summit. 
And we got eight points today, six or eight points, I don't remember. Um, should be eh, round eight. Um, so, beautiful day. Looks like it's starting to rain over there uh, to the west of us. Just a note on the pack. I know you've heard me say this before, but uh, I carry enough stuff uh, to be able to um, survive over the overnight in case I hurt myself uh, waiting for a rescue. And here's a picture of uh, the Apache County rescue team. So uh, you're probably saying to yourself, yeah, it's probably a good idea to pack something for overnight just in case you have to stay up there because it's going to take those guys a while. You know, because they got to stop and feed the horses and yeah, <laughs> who knows what else. But uh, anyway, there's that. We're going to head back down to the car. We got 36 contacts today and uh, seven summit to summits. So actually, that, that uh, good day out here. Easy summit. I did not expect to be able to drive as close as I did. Um, you just need something with clearance. All wheel drive came in handy, maybe one time, but um, it's not necessary as long as it's dry. I think when it rains up here, it's going to be a, it could be a whole different story on this uh, soil. But uh, man, there's a lot of cactus up here. So choya and some other stuff. So very prickly, but uh, yeah, beautiful day. Heading back down. I'd say um, you can do this hike, you know, with 10 pounds, I mean, or less. Bring some water and some gear. I did my first summit after my um, surgery. So I got, I got six holes put into me and uh, they use a robot to fish something out of my gut there. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, I just wore a knapsack on my first hike. Um, I think it was like three weeks after my surgery. Went out and did a, just a small, easy hike with a knapsack, had some water, basic radio stuff. I'm sure it was under 10 pounds. So um, we're at only 21 pounds today, but you can certainly do it lighter. But uh, I've got a rain shell in here and other stuff as we've discussed. Um, if you want to see my complete loadout, and I don't carry all that stuff all the time, but uh, go to hamninja.com slash loadout. Um, or you'll see a link at the top that says loadout. Um, so if you want to know more about doing this hobby, go to hamninja.com slash SOTA360. I did a four part series on activating and then one for chasing. And uh, I've got a couple others out there for CW, learning CW and uh, maybe using your mapping program a little bit more. I'm um, using Gaia GPS today um, and have been for a while. And then I have a, there's some other links on there you might want to follow. Um, so yeah, it's a, a lot of fun and I hope to catch you on the air the next time. I'm going to let you go here. I'm going to roll the credits and uh, enjoy your day. Thanks for watching. Oh, if you want to see my ego get bigger and who doesn't want to see that, push the like and subscribe. 73 guys.